We built this outdoor sectional for less than $200 and we're gonna show you how. Depending on where you live, the lumber might be more expensive, so go ahead and do a little research on your local stores to see how much it's gonna cost you, but for us, it cost about $176 here in Oklahoma for all of the lumber needed. I listed all of the materials that you need for this project, as well as the different tools, a miter saw or chop saw, a drill, two and a half inch or two and three fourths inch deck screws, a tape measure, and you should be good to go. I also listed all of those specific cuts that you need to do right here, but if you want, I'm gonna go ahead and put a link in the description to the Anna White website, which has all of the details there as well. All of the graphics that I'm using are from the Anna White website. So those are the exact cuts that you need to be making. And uh, if you follow those precisely, it'll make it really, really simple and go by quickly. It's definitely possible to do by yourself, but it is easier with somebody else if they can help hold it and keep things steady. So the first one my wife and I did together, the second one I did by myself. So it is definitely possible both ways. When it came to putting on the two by fours for the base, I just went ahead and used another little scrap piece of a two by four to make sure all of the spacing was perfect. You can see me doing that there. Another tip you wanna make sure you're doing is when you're building your second sectional, make sure that your bench is lined up the proper way. If you do them both the exact way, there's only one direction that you can put the bench where it's gonna fit right. So if your porch is small or just depending on the size of wherever you're putting it, you wanna make sure that it is facing the right way. I did end up switching uh, one of the arms to another bench. So just make sure you check before and uh, that way you can do it properly. If you don't want to stand by hand, grab an electric or an orbital sander. You'll save a lot of time. And uh, I like to round those edges too, just to make sure they're not very sharp. We use Sherwin-Williams Weather Shield Exterior Semi-Gloss Paint, and uh, we just used white. And so if you're not using treated lumber, this is important to use and to do two coats of because you want to make sure that all of the surfaces are covered so that water cannot come in and rot the wood. We got our cushions from Overstock.com. The brand is Arden Selections, and they have a two pack for about $60. So it did cost us about an extra $200 to get all of the cushions for the sectional, but that is obviously not mandatory. You can do it however you wish. This is just what we preferred to do, and it worked out for us. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments, and we'll try to answer as many as we can. Thanks for checking this video out. Bye.